हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू वेट नॉलेज प्लीज सब्सक्राइब द चैनल वेलकम बैक इन अ न्यू वीडियो व्हिच इज बेस्ड ऑन रजिस्टरिंग ग्रैंड स्ट्रीम फोन ऑन येस्टार पीवीएक्स सो टुडे आई हैव येस्टार एस फोर वन टू पीवीएक्स एंड जे आर पी टू सिक्स जीरो वन पी एंड जे एक्स वी थ्री थ्री एट जीरो आई पी फोन सो एज यू कैन सी द डिटेल्स द पीवीएक्स हैज डिफॉल्ट आई पी एंड द पासवर्ड व्हिच आई हैव मेंशन हियर नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू लॉग इन द पीवीएक्स After login, you can see the desktop version of this PBX. Here we can see all the options, and we can get here settings, CDR, PBX monitor, and other options, and Linkus soft phone application, which is available for mobile and desktop. Now I'm going into the general setting option. here you can change the extension currently the pbx has default 1025299 extension range now i'm going into the security option and in service option so here i'm enabling allow weak password option and security level to low level so that i can use normal passwords for registration now i'm navigating to extension option here we have two options single or batch so i am adding bulk add option so in bulk add option the start extension range is 1000 and create number is 5 so total 5 extension will be created now i'm setting the extension password as fixed and setting the password here and user password i'm leaving as default now in feature option by default voicemail is enabled we have to disable this and the rest of the settings should be set to default now i'm saving this setting so we have created five extension and now i'm applying the changes so now i'm going to log in the ip phone so first of all i'm registering grp 2601p and i'm configuring first account now enabling and entering the details so i'm using extension 1000 and entering the sip server as the yester pbx ip address as you can see here and in the sip user id and authentication id field i am giving extension number and authentication password admin at 121 as we have set in the pbx now we can verify the account status so this phone is registered now i move to the gxv3380 and we similarly register the extension in this phone so similarly i register first account in this phone and i am using 1001 sip server as the yester pbx ip address sip user id and authentication id 1001 and the password so saving and applying changes now this phone is as well registered on the yester pbx so as you can see i have registered grp2601p on yester pbx extension 1000 and GXV3380 with the extension 1001. So I'm calling from here and dialing the extension number. I can see the call is coming and the call is connected. Similarly, I can call 
from here on video phone extension so you can see the call is coming here and we can communicate and in the same way we can see the concurrent call status from the PBX web UI so now I answered the call and the call is connected and we can see the extension status as well here in the extension option PBX monitor so you can see both the extensions are busy